Welcome. How far are you? Yes, you. From Gabe Newell, CEO of Valve, one of the creators of Steam, a go-to digital distributor of PC games, and by all accounts a great guy. In other words, through how many friends you have to go through to reach Gaben. And I'm not asking in a creepy way or anything, really. Six degrees of separation, all of us are at most six social connections away from each other. But does this hold when it comes to Steam friends? Also, which gaming communities are, on average, closer to Gaben? Finally, is this the most stupid video idea ever? In terms of the last question, yeah. But to answer the other two, I had to spend a month with a bit of programming, a dash of data analytics, and with a lot of coffee. But let's go one step at a time. To find out how close I am to Gaben, I had to figure out who knows him. Sadly, to prevent superfans like me from following him, Gaben made his Steam profile private. But 73 Steam users who have a Valve employee badge did not. Given that it's likely they met the man, they provide me with a direct connection to Gaben. They also provide me with my ticket. Though not sure where yet. Using Valve employees as a starting point, I found out that they have around 2500 friends. None of whom are me. The same story continues at the third connection level, as none of the 110,000 people who are friends with Valve and Please friends are me. Going one level further, I found out that people who are three connections away from Gaben have around 6.8 million unique friends. Given that in the beginning of 2024, Steam had around 130 million monthly active users, this means that at least 5% of the active user base are four connections away from Gaben. And this makes it hurt much more, as I'm not one of them. I'm starting to think that Gaben does not really like me. But then, I lied. I found out that one of my Steam friends has friends who are 4 connections away from Gaben. This means my Steam friend is 5 connections away and I'm 6. Considering that I'm quite an introvert and only have 3 Steam friends, 2 of whom I haven't talked to in 5 years, an average Steam user who plays online games and has at least several Steam friends is probably something like 5 to 4 connections away from the man. And this means you, given you're not as sad as me. But what if I or you want to be closer to him? Maybe there's a gaming community that we could join to make this a reality. And if this is what you're thinking about, then the remainder of this video is for you. But you're also a creep, just like me. To figure out what gaming community is closest to him, I randomly selected 1000 Steam users from each of the top 100 Steam games. And to make sure that these people provide a good representation, I only analyzed those with at least 10 hours of gameplay in the last two weeks in the relevant games. From there, I calculated how many friends each of these people have to go through to reach Gaben. Finally, I averaged this number of connections for each game, which serves as a representation of how close each gaming community is to Gaben. But before going into top and bottom 5 communities, I want to share some other interesting insights from the data. On the one hand, people with more friends are more likely to be closer to Gaben. I know, shocking. But, to be more precise, someone with 50, 100, 150 friends is around 8, 18 or 41% likely to be 4 or fewer connections away from Gaben respectively. On the other hand, playtime does not seem to have a very strong effect on closeness, as there is almost no difference between those who played 10, 20, 30 or more hours in the past two weeks. And there are also no large differences in closeness between players who predominantly play Valve games, mainly play multiplayer games or those who play newer games the most. But there are clear top and bottom communities. And starting with the former, the fifth furthest community from Gaben is Battlefield 1. But also the second furthest is Battlefield 5. I guess Valve employees do not like EA. 
Or maybe they just don't like such games, which means less interaction with people that do. Then we have Russian Fishing in the 4th position and Heroes Land in the 3rd. It's very likely you never heard about these games, even though they are in the top 100. But why they are in the top is because they are mainly popular with the Eastern European and Asian crowds, which is also likely the reason why these gaming communities are relatively far from Gaben. And then, at the bottom, we have Naraka Blade Point, an action battle royale that, just like Russian Fishing and Heroes Land, is relatively not that popular in America or Europe, but it's huge in Asia, which likely explains why its community is furthest from Gaben. Leaving the worst, let's talk about the best. At 5th position we have Lost Ark, a South Korean MMO that is also somewhat popular with the Western crowd. I guess the waifu power carried it, which will be the story for several games at the top. Then fourth, we have Helldivers 2, a cooperative third-person shooter that currently is the darling of many gamers. The closeness might be attributed to it being similar to Left 4 Dead in gameplay and similar to Team Fortress 2 and some other Valve games in humor. Speaking of which, at third position we have the often forgotten child, Team Fortress. Two. And though Valve tries to distance themselves from this game, it managed to beat off hmm, uh, Dota 2, which was 11th, Love for Dead 2, which was 43rd, and Counter Strike 2, which was 73rd in terms of closeness to Gaben. But it did not manage to overcome the furries, weebs, and the waifu lovers, as in the second place we have VR Chat. To be honest, not sure why its players are close to Gaben. But I guess when I was using furry and weep images to represent Valve and Bleas, there was more to it than just a joke. And then, finally, we have the first place, which is held by Final Fantasy XIV, an MMORPG that, I heard, has a good story with combat that aged well. This might also be the reason why Valve and Bleas gravitate toward it. Or maybe they're just weeps who are in it for high quality waifus and husbandos that this game provides. And looking at the games in the top 5, it seems the later is more likely. But whatever the case is, it's still better than spending over a month to figure out who is closest to Gaben. Maybe I should reevaluate my choices in life at least a bit. Yeah.